Well, the Tobago Council of the People's National Movement is condemning statements made by their political rival. The PNM and the Progressive Democratic Patriots held their final motorcades on Sunday in Tobago. TTT News caught up with a section of the PNM's motorcade in Roxborough. Karen Cozier Phillips reports. TTT News caught up with a section of the PNM's motorcade in Roxborough. Public Relations Officer of the PNM Tobago Council, Kwesi Devines, was pleased with the show of support. In the report is we have well over probably 1,500 cars here with us, um, maxis, buses, and it's really a resounding signal that Tobagonians really support the PNM still. And he condemned statements by PDP leader Watson Duke made on the political platform. There's a song a long time ago that David Rudders, Rudders sang about the ransom of a madman. And I think very clearly that's what we're seeing. Um, Mr. Duke is unraveling in the face of declining numbers of yesterday on his part. Um, by all reports, the crowd that they had yesterday was abysmal. And I think the pressure of the reality of our impending election loss is really taking its toll. At a campaign meeting on Saturday, Mr. Duke made offensive statements against Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley and two young women from Tobago. The PDP leader was silent on the matter today. This is a procession where we mark the death of the PNM. And we are also saying that our last words were our last words. You don't get a chance to say last words. All right? So, who vexed loss? Karen Kozia-Philip, TTT News.